Good morning, friends. Today we're going to talk about parts of a plant. And right now, there's probably lots of flowers that are going to grow because springtime means time when we grow. And I had our little Easter bunny because he's growing his flower. And this is our flower, as you can see. But it has to start somewhere in the dirt. Those, my friends, are called roots. There's the word roots. And then when he waters it, the roots start to grow and out pops the stem. That's the word stem. And the bunny rabbit still has to water a little more or the rain from, from heaven. And then out comes some leaves and then the flower grows. And there's lots and lots of different flowers. Here is one of our flowers that we have from Clifford. You guys know my Clifford. You love Clifford. And this says, here comes the sunflower. And that's the name of this sunflower. A sunflower starts as a tiny seed. But it can grow to be taller than you, my friends, you. How does it grow so tall? Let's think about that for a second. I wonder how it grows. We're going to open up my magazine and we're going to find out how it grows. Look at all the fun things in the sky. A sunflower grows. And here it says, a sunflower seed is panted in the dirt. It needs water and sunshine to grow. And there is where we see the sunflower seed going in. Next, the seed has roots. And then out pops the stem. And then there's, what are those called? Did you say leaves? Yep, that's right. There's plenty of leaves up there. Those help the tree grow too, or the flower grow too. Next is our number three, blue three. And this says the stem grows taller. Leaves grow on the stem. The stem, the bud grows on the stem. And there's the bud right there. It's not open yet. That's when we call a bud. If you walk around and you see little buds on the trees, that means all the leaves will be growing. Next is our number four. You got it in yellow. And number four says, look how tall the sunflower is now. It's big and yellow. And it's open, so it's a flower. And look at this little boy. Oh my goodness, it is bigger than him. And then number five, brown number five. The flower dries up and the seeds right there, they fall into the dirt. And guess what? Next year, they will become another sunflower that grows. And... Clifford says, be a sunflower, curl up in a small seed, and grow tall. That is always fun. Let's see what's on the other side here. And I know you don't have this at home. But it does say, if you, my friends could draw a sunflower on a piece of paper. You can use any colors you want. This asks the flowers to be yellow, the leaves to be what color? Green. And the stem to be green. And the roots in the, in the dirt need to be brown. But I know my friends like to use lots of different colors, so that's okay this time. You can draw a couple flowers. It could be a sunflower, it could be a rose, or any flower you want. And ask mom or dad to take a picture of it and send it to your teacher. And I think that would be lots of fun. 
Thanks again, friends, and I miss you all so much. Have a great day.